Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night. This is Julia with JF Greek Freedom. Today we have Marcy and Josie Dubai. And I um, would like to thank the Lord and give him credit for blessing me with these words that go out to the nations and kingdoms of the earth to root out and pull down, destroy and throw down, or to build and to plant. So Mr. Z doesn't even know this, but I used to think of him as the ring wraith, but now recently I think of my own self as a ring wraith, even though I'm not like a the evil <laughs> version of that. Um, so you'll hear why I think of myself in that way. All right, he was actually talking to Stefan there for a second. He says, Oh, you got a little ring wraith of a girl, man, who got one foot in the spiritual realm already, bro. What with my guide in her daily of no. Earned it, bro. She for show put her pretty little searching for friendshipy foot down when I told her to, man. And therefore, she almost went. So she for sure deserved my preserving her daily, man. Otherwise, this would be no one and done. And I saw this. Kill her spirit on this day, and that, and it's over, folks. Baby girl gonna slit her wrist like tomorrow, bloke. And he winked. Nah, man. And as sad as she gets sometimes about me, man. She keep his whole turning, hey, pretty little Julie eyes to me, folks. When she need a little encouraging encouragement of no. Oh, it like that for her, sis. So while you go on ahead and try to convince yourself, doll, that I for sure can't speak into your heart and convict you of, Exactly, doll. Right in my word, isn't it, chick, that I sent the holy as hell spirit into the world, man, to convict the so-called sinners of all of them, man. And we just about love to jump into the hearts of all people at times, man, and see just how they'd react of no, to no little heart prongings of no. Exactly, doll. Can feel it sometimes, can't you, miss? That, yeah, Lord, so I don't know what it actually is about her. But today I'm actually feeling a little bit smarmy of no. When I think about how I treated her with no respects to her sauce of no. Oh, it her life, hun. So nah, sis. One more little diss of no. For show sure don't make no difference, sauce of no. At this point in her. Hated much, doll. And we mean even by strangers, chick. So why you over there thinking you gonna make it up to her by? Nah, sis. Nothing to... Simple, doll. Keep it real effin'. Yeah, man. So I think, bruh, that it about time to have the Julie and Stefani as over for dinner tonight. What do you think, bro? Oh, it gon' be like that for them one day, folks. But until then, dear ones. Oh, she fightin' hard, my loves, to hang on to a few little trinkin' they trink. Trinkets in have you, bloke, that comin' from my pretty... Pretty, ain't they, bruh? These nice little words that fallin' from hay. And well, fallen dude, the man is going to be fallen for her and soon, boys, all just because he see that she. So she a fighter, bro, in the simplest of all ways, folks, trying to just put one jewelry or foot in front of another one, dear ones, day after long as hell day of no, that right, man, no social life to speak of, folks. For now, miss, but well, boys, well endowed, I've got plenty of contacts here for you, miss. To just pick your pick, sis, and tell me where you'd like to go tonight, hun. Cause we for sure can't hang out at yo. All alone of no. Cause you a little bit too pretty stir sauce in a certain way, boys, if you catch my. Oh, she jiggly, bro, and cuddly too, man. But should you, bro, just keep on obsessing about another man's. Exactly, dog. Gonna be his wife one day, folks. So nah, sis. No need to go on and peg her for. Just wait for it, chick. And yeah, miss, so I mean when she get to leave her maxity missus in the bedroom behind of no. Oh, he were terrible, bro. So therefore it were a little bit easier for her to walk away from his idiot of a lifetime, folks, and one that she's still catering to, miss. And yeah, doll, so we mean literally, chick. Lasagna, man. She for show sure spent hours in the kitchen, dude, making his don't even deserve it in my view pop up. But I know that he like it when I mix it all up for him menu-wise of no menus, dog. The girl made menus and shopping lists and pastime stall to try to please his. Didn't give one ounce of a F about it, bro. Exactly, dog. Douchebag and a half to her miss for like years, hun. So naw, doll. 
You for sure don't get a free pass for claiming he basically a knight in shining. Ain't nothing shining on his A. No mole man in have you chick, and she just about. So we gon' be right on time with all this bloke, truly man. Otherwise she gon' wig, hey Julie wig, out on us man, that we not gon'. Oh, we gon' pull some strings for her man, in the spiritual realm bro, to get her to see the Julie light that's me man. She lose inside of me folks, when she turn her pretty little eyes to that there Raging its satanic -y rage, waters of no. <laughs> Every day, man. And if, bruh, baby girl just stand at her to watch no little batty waddies fly by at night of no. Oh, he's sending them, dog. Yeah, folks, so I speak of amby wamby wambulances of no one, two, three, and four sometimes, dude. Just drive and they drive past her, all just so she won't forget that he. Jolly Bob. <laughs> I just got the so right. So right. so right. uh, yeah, I like to stand and look out my window at night sometimes because uh, we have a little area with some some animals live there, including bats and birds. <laughs> and um, also, we're not too far from the zoo, so I can hear at night. I can hear the lion, the male lion roars at night. So. That's kind of interesting to hear it. Um, I'm not one of those people that thinks like all the animals in the zoo should be free, but when I hear him roaring at night, I, I sort of get that feeling. The, the fact that it carries as far as it does is pretty amazing. Okay, so the girls are a little bit too interested, so if you hear the TV in the background, I'm sorry. Okay, so here we're talking about Okay, so he was talking about how Mr. Z was trying to prove that he with the ambulances. And he do, man, he do. But we dear ones. Well, so we love her, miss. That right, gal. And as much as you think you justified to go on gossiping about her the Lord shook his head. Uh uh, gal. Nope. Not in the heavenly cards for like any of you, miss, to go around and disparage your fellow brothers and sisters in Christ, hun. It's what she is to you, miss. I know, gal. And how could a formerly like a Ruthie pagan of a chick actually turn her heart towards and be drifted into no Boazi territory of no? When we little Israeli sauce of chickies been sitting here and working our butts off to show him that Eh, yes and no, doll, for the flesh, chick. You've been working all this out with him in your fleshly as hell brain of no versus praying to me about it of no. And there, doll, is your Achilles heel in all this, hun. Because when I say two people meant to have an ancestor of Christ, baby of no, oh, it were set in the stars, hun, just like hey little mishap of a story with well, so it like everybody and they dog by now, miss. Who misunderstanding her huh? and hey, of no. But that all right, sis. For once, a lovely little woman of mine get to pack up and move hay bags into the house of no Boazie of a tip who gon' protect hay till the end of all time, dude. It's kind of why she needed change of scenery, folks. This Maxity bloke don't even believe her anymore, bro. When she says she saw and coincidences, folks. He just think it all one big maxity waxity coincidence, boys, that he got to tap that for a time, boys, for a time, man. Till she finally put her pretty little Julie foot down of no in like 2022, bro. So yeah, dog, he getting a little bit maxi waxy jealous, bro, that she won't let him see her. Oh, he want them again, finally, bro. Saggy tits of a lifetime bloke. But nah, man. Not actually meant to belong to yo. Although she appreciates yo. Moves of a lifetime, man. To lift up a pretty little gallopine spirit of no. And for now, it's fine, bro. But once he come hopping his Stephanie hop along of no. Oh, you gonna have to back yo back down, dude. A little bit, man. 
If you want to stay off of no stephonery of a radar dude, that pretty condemned sharp for a man dude. We know, a no man. Oh, she attracted him dude. Smart as hell whippersnappers of dudes on this channel man. Truly dude. And not just yo. But well, secrets bro. Of all that she... Cause she for sure got a darkster side of an audience who following her moves around online. Much as hell closer if they could, dog. But, well, silent as hell. Profiteki chicks, bro. And how sometimes they can drive them crazy by not actually saying exactly, dog. And, shh, bro. You for sure attracting some predators to yourself when you go on ahead and talk about. The Lord also used the word complain. When you go on ahead and complain about. Oh, we'll get there, bro. And yeah, man, so I mean heaven, bro, where nobody really allowed to abuse. Exactly, hun. It's called verbal abuse, doll, and it's written in my word as gossip and strife, chick. It's what you cause, and doll, when you keep. Just keep it up, doll, and see if I won't punish you for. Errors of a lifetime, chick, and ones that you perpetrate on my very own. So she is saint to me, chick, and very well known already in Himmel, folks. Cause I for sure already had to fire a few. All just cause they keep falling in love with hay. Exactly, dog. Not the only one, man. And the gal is pretty well able to pull on the heartstrings of any man that she lets get a little bit close to her. Of no. But careful, dog. She real effing careful about. Exactly, bro. That. And it gon' remain her Achilles heel in this lifetime, bro. That she could so easily lay down with yo, care much for her a, for at least one little night of love making, bro. But after that, dog, oh, she gonna be poofster sauce into his arms one day, chick, and one day, wait for it, chick, before you go on freaking out on her a of, we'll take care of it all, chick, and we mean like. Um, yeah, I wasn't quite sure what the commentary should be about today, and I try not to, like, premeditate on it, but uh, several touchy subjects for today, uh, in my view, about me, but um, just in general, I'm not supposed to give specifics, but the Lord's words to me, in my mind, are very, very sweet and very kind. They're also there in the journals, so Mr. Z could probably guess some of the things he's saying to me, but um, that in itself... It does keep me going from day to day, so I try to take each day as it comes and try not to think too much about um, the next day or the day before, because thinking about the day before and what happened then, is um, <laughs> there's usually something negative I can find uh, from Mr. Z's side, and there's usually something positive I can find from the Lord's side. Um, so I just try to stay in the present and think on think on some of the things that he tells me, but, um, until <laughs> I'm a little bit like a man in that sense, I'm waiting for the proof in the pudding. So until that happens, um, just like, okay, there's some nice things you got to say there, but, <laughs> um, but I try not to finish my sentence cause he will, he knows how I feel. So I don't even have to finish the sentence. He knows exactly what I, what I feel. And can continue talking to me in a way that works for me. So, okay, I think we're gonna turn it off because Mama's finished, basically. All right. So, thank you for any prayers that you may be sending my way. Um, yeah. <laughs> It's kind of hard for me to find a balance between admitting my weaknesses and not. So I'll just leave that to the Lord and y'all sort of have an idea how I'm doing at this time. And uh, if I haven't said it, thank you for any prayers. Girls, do y'all want to say bye to the Lord? Bye. Okay. Bye. All right. God bless. Bye.